What's going on in the plot there is that what we are talking about is women fully dressed in armor are riding to a battlefield and deciding who is going to be killed and then they help in the whole slaughtering and then carry the dead bodies to heaven. Okay. And what you played was much too nice. Okay. It's absolutely not funny and it's not beautiful. Right. It's very, very bloody and I'm not talking about some drops of blood there standing in the blood until here right. and uh, are dirty but it's um, yeah, okay now I'm leaving the ground of um, sure interpretation but the Valkyries are supposed to be the daughters of Wotan and are at least half mm -hmm. or fully gods or whatever they're supposed to be very beautiful maybe there's some kind of erotic uh, part in that as well when Wagner wrote about women in armor hell knows what he thought <laughs> uh, that's my job that's the job of the Wagner <laughs> right, exactly. biographer however uh, well yeah it, it, it for me it should and what also this um, I think the the sense of the 9 8 bar is uh, it's a ride and all the, the rider marches of, of the time and the time is always 6 8 normally so you have this yam -bam 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 is about to get this um, gallop character of a ride mm -hmm. so f it would be nice if we could get more um, uh, yeah more transparency in that that rhythm thing it was very good it was very clear but for me you're looking too nice okay. it looks very good when you play and it sounds very good and very beautiful and everything but it could have more of that of that character it doesn't mean that we have to play more or louder but all the yeah it could be more yeah more, more more difference between the notes and more pushing okay and also actually the theme this bum bum ba -dum -bum -bum comes three times mm -hmm. the first time without us this is the second time right and this is the third time right normally the third time i think as far as i when we i played it myself the third time is a little slower and little with the full set and everyone's playing right. as loud as possible and da dush da da di da dush and then all the, the, the symbols and everything mm -hmm. <coughs> okay can you play the first one sure For example, the very first beginning, uh, okay, we were talking and it was cold, but you could maybe um, with the upbeat, and the upbeat is, I oh know, sorry, you're playing there, yeah. is an opportunity to put a lot of weight on the first, on the first B here. Okay. To get, so that... <laughs> that you already start like that okay. and then you're also pick yeah and later on when the symbols everything the heavy things are always on the one yeah. so that we have <laughs> this has always to be very heavy okay. oh, that, that could be heavier Okay, but could you make 
an angrier face or something. It, it still is much too nice for me. Okay. And I still see you, you know, it's, it's about wrecking the whole world, what's going on there. And you, that looks not involved enough for me. Okay. And also maybe you could, um, you need another, maybe you can have put more dark energy in your sound. And maybe it, f for me, it looks as if you would not be taking a real deep breath for it. Okay. And that could be an opportunity. One, two, <laughs> that you start like that with a really full set of air. Okay, and now you're playing beautiful bell notes on this one, but there are uh, only quarters with a with a dot without mm -hmm. any further information. Okay. So play them absolutely plain or take them even off. Okay. Because the more you give on the long notes, the more you distract the uh, uh, concentration right. from the from the real heavy part. <laughs> simple and with more yeah think more of the riding and the horses okay. <clears throat> the upbeat could still make more weight on the first one <laughs> okay that was a nice beginning and now don't waste too much air and energy on the long notes the long notes are something you, it always goes yam pam pa dam pi pa pam pa dam pi pa pam. So actually, if if we would imagine it visually, it would be pam pam pa dam pi pa pam pa dam pi pa. What you try now is pam pim pa dam pi pa pam pa dam. That makes it plain again. Okay. Now is something uh, maybe it's a general tendency, but I hear something that is similar than in the um, Pulcinella. You're starting quite, quite, yeah, with with very good articulation, very nice accents, mm -hmm. but they get softer and softer. Okay. And it should stay like that all the time. And uh, uh, yeah, and about the long notes, much better. Okay. Like this, good. because then you have an opportunity to to push it ahead. The worst thing that can happen if you play there and it starts to be uh, laid back or comfortable or whatever, mm -hmm. it should, you should try to hurry a little bit. Okay. <coughs> no, they have still to uh, bring all the dead bodies to Valhalla on the day. They don't have time to waste. We're getting some some character into it. Yeah. Don't try to play them. Uh, yeah. Equal. There's nothing democratic about music. There's every note is different. Right. And don't try to to play them the same or the like or equal or whatever. Okay. <coughs> the one is better than the others. Right. Okay. This the second. Sure. <laughs> Thank you. The second part. They're absolutely the same again. Mm -hmm. Still more weight <coughs> on the one. Bam, bam, ba -dam, ba. And there maybe even if you take a little bit more time for it, because this is the one when the whole orchestra takes a deep breath and now is everything is really big. <laughs> and so on. Heavy but uh, 
ahead. And don't lose energy. Okay, okay, okay. Not bad. But I still have all the time the impression I would have to keep you going. Okay. It's not about the tempo. It's the way of inter the interpretation of the tempo. Okay. It can be heavier, but that has nothing to do with being slower or faster or whatever. It has to be pushing all the time. I think you play the... Um, sorry. Yeah, it's that, no? No, there. Sorry. <laughs> You use, you use the slide like that? Um, no, I actually play this note in kind of a raised okay. fifth and then this Because note. there was... I know it, I learned it even like that. Mm -hmm. For me it's simpler. Okay. It's maybe a little bit more dangerous and you have to um, find the intonation on the fifth slide, but mm -hmm. I found it then afterwards easier to find the intonation on the fifth than to be okay. on time and find the intonation with a long ways from the first to the right. fifth okay. all the time. It's maybe worth to do an experiment. Sure. But then make up your mind before the one day before the audition. Right. If you do it, <laughs> say, okay, which version do I play then? Uh, that, that will surely go <laughs> not well. Yeah. Okay, but uh, let's come to an end. Just play it once. And sure. Please seriously think about the women in armor. It is still not nasty enough. Okay. It's too funny. And you still look too uh, enjoying. Okay. It's not funny. And it's not uh, evil. It's really evil. It's Darth Vader evil. It's really, really, really bad what's going on. Okay. And it's still much too funny what you play. That has nothing to do with playing loud or whatever, but it needs a, a kind of a seriousness and a kind of, yeah, it should be darker somehow. Yeah, very good. 